guys how you doing vertigo here and welcome back to another episode on the dark frost server guys yes i managed to find some time to record through my all my revision and everything and yeah i did quite a bit on the server and i thought i should um give you a little update of what's going on i mean oh what's this i well i didn't think i changed much but yeah um me and Limps decided to remodel the spawn area. If you remember from the l end of last video, um, it was like a big stone slab circle and everything with the enchanted table off to the side. Well, we thought that was too similar to the star we went with on the last map. And we changed it to this little natural look and everything. And hopefully all the pathways will end up looking like this. Um, yeah, and I think that's pretty cool, don't you think? Um, we got this food chest for beginners, which needs to be refilled. Um, plus an ender chest, the anvil, and of course the enchanted table fully set up and everything. And yeah, over here, you can see I've done quite a bit to my base as well. Um, instead of just this little farm and all that, it's now the two stories, the wheat on top, the carrots and potatoes on the bottom. And we've got a nice little roof and everything, and yeah. We've got the whole waterfall look going on. And today I finished off the walls here because they both had dirt and all that up beside them. So I decided to change it that. Plus I installed this little staircase to get up as well. And yeah, I think it's quite nice, quite simple, quite cosy. And yeah, now I've got to just uh, cut here quickly and show you guys to the next part of my base. And we're back. Um, yeah. We're in the underground part of my base. Uh, my actual base, you know. Um, yeah, because, I don't know. I didn't feel like my little farm area and everything was suitable for a base. So I got this secret little spot underground that some people on the server know how to get to. Some of us don't. Um, and yeah. This is going to be like my little side project. I'm going to put my storage and all that down here. Um, maybe in my own enchanting setup. Some other stuff. I'm sure I'll figure out what to put down here. But it's pretty much all, you, all you're going to see here is going to be my base. I'm not going to make it too big because, yeah, eventually I'm just going to move out here and forget about the place, you know. Um, so what would be the point in doing that? Alright, I just wanted to show you that. And yeah, let's get back to the rest of the server I wanted to show off. Okay guys, we're just heading over to that area that you can see off in the distance there. But I thought I'd stop here um, and mention the fact that me and Miko brought over cows to the spawn island. Which was a lot of effort, I'll tell you that much. And yeah. So this here is Jumali's area and he's been doing an amazing job. I mean this looks, this looks just beautiful. I really like the natural design he's been going with down there. Um, yeah. And up here, he's just got some little stuff going on. Uh, some random chests. I don't know what that say. Took the... Oh, yeah. That was me and Limps when we were making the thingy over there. Um, and, yeah. He's just got little houses and all that down here. It looks like that's a storage area in progress. Um, got, like, a little viewing area and all that. And, yeah. It's generally a nice base. Oh, yeah. I forgot. This goes to nowhere. So just a what? Oh. Okay. Yeah, just a one staff members of the server. Don't blindly run up these stairs because you will fall off and you might not be able to hit the water. Um. Yeah. I don't. I. I feel like I've done a lot of cuts because of that little secret area that I don't want to like show off the entrance to. You know. Um. Yeah, but this map is getting underway. Uh, we'll just explore this other area of Jumali while I talk about that. Yeah, the map's getting underway. Um, we found the end portal. And we've already got a beacon, as you've seen. And I'm pretty proud of that. I'm pretty happy uh, with how this community's getting on. And how this, uh, this map is 
proving to be quite entertaining and everything. Oh. That is a lot of quartz. Um, but yeah, same thing goes for me, guys. I'm trying... I'll record, try and record whenever I can. Um, but I can't guarantee that I'll be able to. And there might be massive gaps in between videos. Dark Force will probably be my main series because... Um, my main series to record. Because it's just the easiest to record for me. Um... Yeah, and on with what we're going to do today. We are going to make the pathway. Uh, we're going to have a pathway. Come out from the staircase like here. Uh, we're going to wrap it around here. Bring it outwards and upwards. Yeah, why not? Yeah, upwards. And it's going to meet up with the area right here, you know. So it'll be a nice little curve, kind of. Um, not too much, though. We'll, we'll need to move my furnaces, um, but that's okay. I can just move them down, or not down, um, around. That's that's the word. Like yeah, like around like this. Yeah. Um, we're gonna make it in a similar design like this. Like set start the themes for spawn, so other people know. Hey, this is the pathway we're going with. Um. I'll put this off camera, but I'll switch this pathway out as well to one of those and link it up to the pathway here to Dalek's little granite thing. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to grab the materials together and then we'll get on with that. Okay, guys. We are back. And I just laid out the slabs for like the staircase going down. And I thought I would show off to you how... We, I kind of went about making this area here with limbs. Um, we're going to have to remove this, actually. So, I just started off by... My shell's going to probably break here. But I, like... I just dug out randomly. You know? Um, yeah, just a whole random, like, chunk... Um, of mess like this. Um, sometimes I would go along and edit it a little bit. Because I want to make this... Oh, okay. Ooh, because um, I want to make this pathway more solid uh, looking. And yeah, then I would leave it to go solid. Um, I would just start placing blocks randomly. Uh, yeah. Uh, hmm, hmm. But I feel like sometimes I feel like this is way too little um, coarse dirt, so I just add in little bits here and there. Um, uh, we'll need more up here. And yeah, this is how I make the pathways and everything. Let's get rid of that. Um, Oh, that's not normal dirt. That's normal dirt. Um, yeah. that's And then I just do this, you know. Oh, there goes my shovel. I'm going to have to go make a new one. Um, but I can't be asked right to do it right now. Alright. Oh. Don't want that. I want that. Give me that for now. And yeah, that's just how my pathway generally uh, lays out. I really need to get another shovel. But you know what? I'm just going to do this. Gonna go. Uh, ooh, mm, mm. I'm just gonna smell the iron up here because I can't be bothered to go get my iron out of my ender chest. 
Even though it was like right over where we were working. And yeah, um, making that spawn area has actually really kind of inspired me a little bit here because yeah, I haven't done that much proper building in a while. And this is like, I feel this is what I like to call proper building. And yeah, it's quite inspiring, you know, just to get that little extra oomph. I literally, yeah, I literally only need one piece of iron. Um, hello? When did you get back? Sound muted. Alright, <laughs> I just muted my team speak there. I, I forgot that I was in team speak. And, um, yeah, Jumani was in the room with me and he clearly just got back from whatever he was doing. Awkward. Alright. So, yeah, that's how I made the pathway. I'm just going to get to the rest of this now. And I guess I'll be back with you guys to end off the episode, you know. Um, I'm saying you know a lot, so I need to stop. Alright. Yeah. Be right back. Okay guys, so now if we just take a walk through our lovely new pathway, we get all the way up to the stairs for the farm. And I didn't decide to come around like this because, you know, I think people can figure out that they just need to walk over here to harvest this part of the farm by themselves. Like, they, they, they won't need any, they don't need any, um you know, they don't need any guidance from a, a pathway. Alright, let's just do that. And yeah, I pretty much, to do these pathways, mostly I have to uh, bone mill a section of grass, just like this, let's say. And that is loud. Alright, let's just turn it on. Yeah, like this. And I take those shears, and I just break it like that. In case you didn't know though, um, this is how you actually get the tall grass on a server. Is you just um, shear it, yeah. Um... That's all i got time for for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Dark Frost. And if you did, don't forget to subscribe for more Dark Frost. Um, and yeah, that's all i got to say, really. And Except from, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!